install Premiere Pro Beta and make sure you have already added additional event models in Premiere Pro Beta version. Then I already opened the file in my Premiere Pro. So what you have to do is right now is uh, select select this object mask tool if you long click you can get four type of tool this is for object this is for if you want to only blur the face or something like this this is for screen and any random selection i click on this then see it automatically strikes everything i click on the person right if i want to add object i can add object too if i want to subtract i can subtract there is a two way you can uh, edit any you can add any object right see to object over it automatically when you hover it highlights the object And this is a color black and white. I'll select by default. Click on this in object mask. Click on this drag selected mask forward and backward. It is automatically tracking the subject and it is a very good right. So I am stopping this. I already track in this. Right now I am deleting this. And to put text behind what I am doing is I just move objects marks in opacity layer right now earlier it is a earlier it is in assign mask right in assign mask I have to move in opacity like I am disabling this earlier It is here when I drag into the opacity menu it automatically remove the background I can invert or I can subtract something like this right now I am enabling the this clip and I am adding the text look at this so good and if i i can also uh, click on the ball also and i can also track on the ball like this i can select from here ball and so so good and there is so much i can do for example what i can do here is i can uh, color grade here but it is in beta version so a lot of time it uh, freezes the screen right so for the go to the lumetri color and add lumetri colors like this it automatically is move object marks into lumetri panel right say so i can only color grade this also and if i want to do a breakdown i can copy that do it invert I can copy also volumetric color field. 